Hi folks, I'm Ian Baker, the product specialist here at American RV. Today we're going to talk about the 2016 Montana 3711 FL. This is going to be a gorgeous front living room floor plan. This bad boy is going to have six slides. So if you're looking at something that's going to be really comfortable, tons of room, then keep watching because you're going to like what you see. Let's go ahead and start on some of the external features. I want to point out the beautiful front cap that Montana puts on here. That's a painted fiberglass front cap. Uh, just gorgeous, it's going to help against water intrusion. You're also going to see it's cut back a little, bit to, a little bit to help improve your turn radius. Also right here you are going to get an LED light. Uh, that's going to be for hooking up and unhooking at night. You'll also have LEDs built into the front cap which is just going to help make it look really nice. You'll have your mirror here again for backing up. That gives you a perfect view to the pin box so that way when you're backing up you can see what you're doing. Speaking of the pin box, this is going to come fully equipped with the More Ride hitch pin. This is going to give you three inches of travel, which is going to help take out a lot of that bucking and chucking. So that way, you know, as you're starting and stopping, there's going to be rubber in here, helps absorb a lot of that shock, really helps improve your tow experience. Let's take a look underneath. Great storage here. If we take a look, a ton of room there. Off to one side, we do have a separate door, but that's going to be your battery box as well as your battery disconnect there. Uh, but very nice, clean storage here. Plenty of room for added things. Also, I want to show you right here, six-point hydraulic leveling. That's going to be a standard on the Montana, super simple. That way when you get to, uh, get to your campsite, you just touch a button, automatically levels out for you. It does have a memory, so when you're ready to leave, you just hit the button again, and it'll move to right where you dropped it off at. That way you can just back your truck right up. Super simple system. Let's go ahead and open this up. Here's going to be a propane tank, so you're going to have a 30 pound propane tank on this side. You'll also have a 30 pound tank on the other side for 60 pounds of propane there. Slam latch baggage doors. As we open it up, we can take a look. Nice, tall, pass-through storage there. So again, you have the storage up front, you have the pass-through here. In a little bit, I'll show you some extra storage we get in the back. Power awning, of course, and then look at this. I, I love that they do this. This is going to be your frameless windows. Frameless windows are going to give you a couple of advantages. One, just a lot more aesthetically pleasing. They look really nice. Two, uh, you can keep them open while it rains, and also your seals are going to be protected by the glass. That way they're not getting uh, hit by all the elements. They're going to be naturally tinted. Going to help keep a lot of that UV off and protect your, uh, your seals. As we take a look into the entryway of the coach, you're going to get four steps. First one being nice and low, so if you do have bad knees, it's nice and easy to get in. Also to assist you, you're going to have this easy grab rail. Now one of the things I love about Montana, when you open up the door, you can see right down here we're going to have a little switch. This is what they call a welcome home light. So I, it, it seems kind of minor, but that's really neat. As soon as you open the door, your lights turn on, so you're not fumbling into a dark coach trying to find a light switch. Nice and easy, that's how Montana likes to do it. Also, just something of note, this is going to be a full four season coach. So if you are looking to um, you know, camp in the colder seasons, it 100% will handle it. You're not gonna have to worry about anything freezing. And also, Montana will give you your full warranty even if you're a full timer. For your knowledge, a lot of manufacturers won't do that. If they find out you're living in a full time, they'll take that warranty out underneath you. Not Montana, they're gonna stick by your side. Let's take a look here. We're going to have our aluminum rims on there, which are going to be, uh, help prevent a lot of rust. They're also going to look really nice. And right in between, this is going to be the Legacy Edition. And so one of the things they do in the Legacy Edition is they upgrade your suspension system. So if you look right there, you'll see you have the Montana Moride 4100. That's going to give you four inches of travel as you're going down the road. So that's really going to help take a lot of those bumps out again, improving that tow experience. And that's what it's all about, right? The, the good tow experience, great comforts. You have your second door leading in, four stops, nice and simple there. As we move around to the back of the coach, one of the other things you're gonna get with the Legacy Edition is this right here, a rear painted cap. Just a gorgeous fiberglass cap they put on there. Again, it, it, you know, in my mind, it really helps complete the look. A lot of manufacturers aren't doing, that, uh, doing it these days, but it really is a nice look, helps prevent water intrusion. A great thing, uh, a great added value to the coach. 
You're also going to have your ladder here, fully walkable roof of course, so you can get up on the roof for any kind of maintenance or just hang out up there. You'll also see right above where it says Montana, you're going to have a camera. That is a backup camera. So you, you'll get a little portable handheld device you can take with you in your truck. That way you can see as you're backing up, uh, you know, if, that way you can see your spotter a lot easier or if you don't have one, it makes backing up by yourself easier too. Now I talked about when we were up front, extra storage, take a look at this. Boom, open that up, great extra storage in there, plenty of room, you need to put in you know, lawn chairs, fire pokers, anything you need, it's got some room there. All right folks, outside's wonderful, let's go take a look at the beautiful inside. Welcome to the beautiful inside of the Montana 3711 FL. Here's gonna be our front living room. This is gonna be our main feature to the coach. Absolutely gorgeous. Plenty of space for everyone to sit and entertain. Right here at our focal point, we're gonna have very large TV here. You're gonna have the beautiful brick surround, just gorgeous. Underneath, you're gonna have a fireplace that is going to be a fully functional fireplace. So that's gonna run off electric. It's wonderful for taking the chill off on those cold mornings, those cold evenings, and that way you don't have to run the propane. On both sides of the TV, you will have accent lighting as well as electrical plug-ins to plug in any electronics. Down below on both sides, you will get excellent storage as well as both sides up top. Here we're going to have our stereo and on the opposite side, we are going to have our DVD player. Right up top, built into the surround, we're also gonna get this uh, sound bar for superior sound quality. As you can see, we're gonna have LED lights throughout the entire coach. One of the things I love about Montana is gonna be that crowned ceiling. It's crowned inside and outside for, um, for maximum insulation values, really adds a lot of height uh, and character to the coach. Also, you'll see here uh, above the crown molding, we're gonna have an, uh, LED lights behind, really gives nice accent lighting. You can, of course, turn that off if you don't want it, but it is another option that, of course, comes with it. Uh, so we will have our, our sofa here. This is going to be a tri-fold sofa, so this will fold out. And then direct opposite, we're gonna have this uh, excellent L-shaped couch here. This one is going to be a recliner, which is a perfect location right across from the TV. You can kick back and recline. And then this sofa here is also going to be a tri-fold sofa. The great thing about it is you can have them both out at the same time, so you can sleep a lot of guests here. You don't have to tell them, but if you do want to, you are able to do that. Also, right behind, you'll see the shades. These are pull-down shades, MCD brand sh uh, shades, top of the line. Super simple to operate. You just pull them down just like that. You'll see you have a day shade here, which just kind of blocks some of the sunlight, or you get the total blackouts right here. Now, one of the things that I like they did, they went with the, the beige option instead of the black. Kind of helps keep a little bit lighter in here, even though you're blocking out all the sun. Right above my head, you are gonna have your Max Air fan. Does a great job of uh, really getting the air flow through here without having to turn on the AC. You do have two ACs in this unit and of course they will be ducted. Let's go ahead and step down into the kitchen. Beautiful kitchen and one of the things I love about this floor plan is you know it has enough where you get some room segregation. However, because there's not a huge wall, I can still talk to the people in the living room while I'm prepping food. So you get a great view, I can see the TV from here, I can talk to my guests and I can still entertain. So plenty of countertop space as you can see. Starting over here, we get this beautiful uh, countertop. We're gonna have our high-rise brush nickel faucet. This is going to pull out, so make it nice and easy to do dishes. Solid surface countertops. Look at how deep those sink bowls are. You know, a lot of people, when they look at sinks, they just see a double bowl sink. They don't pay attention to your actual depth of the bowl. That's gonna make a huge difference in, in how much the sink can hold and how easy it is for you to do dishes. So nice, deep stainless steel sink. Like I mentioned, it does come with the sink top covers to maximize that countertop space. Shelvings and uh, Shelving in the sides. You get a charging center here, which is great. Plug in a USB, you can put your cell phone right on this little shelf right here, let it charge or you have 120 here. Get storage underneath with a trash can built in so that way you don't have to worry about where a trash can's gonna be. They already uh, put one there for you. And then right here is going to be your central vac. So this is where your hose will plug into or right underneath is going to be a toe kick. So what that does, it's kind of like a hair salon. You can just sweep it up, just kick this up with your toe, put everything in there. When you're done, shut it back down. It works wonders. You get additional storage space right here. 
and then you'll get a bank of four drawers nice drawers here all the way down and again a ton of storage in this galley which we will continue to see here's going to be our convection microwave take a look at the size of that huge convection microwave they put in Montana's which I love because that way you know if you actually want to bake a turkey or something you can fit it in there you're able to do so here's gonna be our weight 13,240 so you do have to have a decent sized truck but it is definitely towable and it does tow uh, tows wonderfully up top here we get extra storage as well as on the side of the microwave there again more countertop space extra plug-in great place if you want to put a coffee maker uh, you know maybe your ninja blender whatever it may be our three stove burner here and of course we do have the uh, tops on that as well again to help maximize our countertop space this is going to be your stainless steel uh, atwood stove top it does uh, have better flame control than its suburban counterpart you'll see there you're going to get a, a standard oven in case you want the traditional oven and we're also going to get storage underneath this is just going to be that backup camera I mentioned. Of course, one part's installed, but there's going to be your handheld device. More drawers. You gotta have drawers in the kitchen. There it is. Here's a, a silverware divider comes for you. Currently, I have some remotes in there as well as the fridge stop. This works really well. All you do is you just screw it right into here, and this keeps all your doors closed when you're traveling neat system there but again huge drawers nice big drawers all the way down let's take a look at our center island again more prep space you know they got to have prep space i love they have it you get an extra uh, additional countertop over here that pops up for you nice and easy you get more drawers look at the hat drawers galore right and then you have storage underneath here too and again more pull out drawers i love it Samsung stainless steel residential refrigerator. Aww. Take a look at that. Plenty of space in here, folks. You have uh, lots of room in your doors. You're gonna have your crispers down here with humidity control. Uh, you get a fresh box right here that's gonna be for uh, a lot of your fresh goods. Just works wonderfully. And then underneath, you're going to have your drawer style freezer. So there's that. Again, residential uh, refrigerator that will run off the batteries and the inverter. And then here's gonna be great storage. So we'll open this side up, right? And this is, this is about what you come to expect for depth. So there's a little bit of, you know, little bit of room there, right? But, you know, great for spices or, you know, um, maybe some Pop-Tarts or something like that. But this is really where it's at. Take a look at that huge deep storage right you don't expect that it's the same on the top that's a massive pantry and what i love about this is they do have plug-ins so if you want to use it for that that pantry you do have um, like an appliance pantry here just plug it in there which is wonderful if you want washer and dryer this is where your washer and dryer would go so this would come out and you can put a stackable washer and dryer in here plenty of room for those stackable units Last but not least, to round out our kitchen area, we're gonna have our dining room. So we get, you can see you get nice windows. I do have the shades closed for uh, video quality, but you know you do get beautiful view right here, which is where your campsite's gonna be, so you can see what's going on. Enjoy your morning cup of coffee or uh, a nighttime meal. Of course, you have this beautiful light fixture here. We, have, we currently have two chairs. It does come with two foldable chairs that look almost identical, which is wonderful. Here, it lifts up, you do get some storage underneath the seats, which is great. Go ahead and put that back. And also the table comes out like this. It does have a leaf in here, so if you do have additional guests, you can make the table a little bit larger so you are able to sit everyone there. Again, the MCD blinds all the way across. Wonderful, wonderful system. Let's go ahead and take a look at the bathroom and bedroom. In our bathroom, we're gonna get this beautiful one-piece residential shower. Uh, you'll see that you have a huge skylight up top, really lets in a ton of uh, a ton of light, and also you get a ton of headroom. So if you're a tall person, you don't have to worry about you know hitting the ceiling in the shower. Of course, you have some great shelves in there. You're also gonna have a hand wand and a, uh, a tri-slide glass door shower enclosure. 
as we see here you're gonna have your stool plenty of leg room that's a porcelain stool there so nice and easy to clean of course we have heat and AC in our bath uh, we have our vanity plenty of countertop space there plug-in storage underneath of course solid surface countertops above that we're going to get our medicine cabinet with a mirror and storage behind that now as we come out of the bathroom, before we go into the bedroom, I want to show you this. Here is going to be your main instrument panel. This will have your inside lights, your outside lights, water heater, tank monitoring system. Uh, this is going to be for our ceiling fan. It does have a ceiling fan, slide rooms, tank heaters. Like I mentioned, we were outside. This is a four season, uh, or four season capable unit. So here's going to be your tank heaters to make sure those don't freeze. You'll also have max fan control there as well. Underneath, you'll see here is going to be a nice coat closet so that way you have place to hang jackets and that's going to be right inside of our second door uh, on your way into the bedroom here but you'll see you have a king bed beautiful beautiful handcrafted headboard there huge king bed they really do a good job I still be able to maximize the shelving uh, you get a shelf with electrical outlets there uh, for any kind of cell phone or anything as well as some cubby holes on the side you're also going to have storage up top with some reading lights underneath and then you're going to have windows on both sides that will open to really maximize airflow. Here we're going to have a nice big picture window. This is great if you're backed up to a beautiful site. Uh, you know, you may have ocean view. You can sit here, take a look out the window. Again, you know, enjoy that morning coffee. Really wake up feeling refreshed, which is wonderful. As we take a look here, plenty of storage folks. Take a look at that. You get great storage in here. And one of the things I do want to point out, because this is a legacy edition, this is going to be solid hardwood. Not just the doors, but all your styles here. There's nothing wrapped. This is all solid hardwood, which is great. Now this rod, I know it's tough to see, but this does go all the way through. So you can hang clothes all the way through. It doesn't stop on either side, which is great. You also get a ton of shelving in here, which is wonderful. Of course, you have your 32 inch TV um, you do have lights in here as well so you have lights to be able to see and of course you have more storage underneath below that you get a wonderful bank of drawers you have nine drawers here for everything else that uh, you're not able to hang all right, folks, again, my name is Ian Baker. I hope you enjoyed the tour. This is the 2016 Montana 3711 FL. Beautiful front living floor plan, very well laid out. You have a, a ton of entertainment space. You have great seating, the beautiful residential fridge, high, uh, high bathroom ceilings, plenty of storage and, and room here in the bedroom. Definitely one you need to come out and take a look at. If you do have any questions or comments, please go ahead and feel free to leave those on the video, or you can give me a call here at American RV and I'll be happy to answer those for you as well. Thanks folks. I have, hope you have a great summer and I can't wait to pass you on the road to freedom.